We are ready, my king. Tell me, Venekis. Have you ever gone fishing with your son? No, never. A soldier's life is all I've had the honor to know. I would have liked to have gone fishing with my son. Spartans! Every breath that you have taken has led you to this moment. Every drop of blood, sweat, and tear, all of it has led to where you stand right now. The Persians come to make slaves of us all. I have a better idea. I say we drench the gods with their blood! What say you, Spartans? For our sons! For our daughters! For Sparta! No 
not so tough without your... No match for a Spartan! We are betrayed, my king. Xerxes knows of the path behind the mountain. They are coming. <laughs> By dawn, he will be completely surrounded. We are Spartans. When are we not? Spartans. That word will mean nothing. Xerxes wipes your bloodline from the face of you. Today was a day the Persians will never forget. Tomorrow is a day the world will remember. Finally. Wow, this is big, Layla. Do you really think it's the spear? This is the one. The book was almost right on top of it. I've never been so lucky in my life. Okay, let's start her up. Are you sure we can trust this thing? I mean, the book could be- Just started, Victoria. You're the boss, boss. I'll prep it for you. Okay, so worth noting, I've made some changes since we're last in here. <laughs> There's no keeping up with the tech industry these days. I can crank up the simulation to maximum sensory synchronization if you're up for it. Let's take this one step at a time. Understood. If you're looking for something a little more intense, I can always adjust the settings for you later. This bit will let me know how much information will be fed to you during your time in the Animus. Give me as much information as you got. There's no way I'm going in there without some guidance. Glad to help. You can always change your mind later. Listen, Layla, before you go off... If this book is right, this fear, this story, it will change everything. You're putting a lot of faith in a fairly unreliable source. Historian or not, this guy wrote about magical objects and the will of the gods. He's not Homer. Irodotos was the first recorded historian, so there's a lot more truth in that text than you think. I mean, what better way is there of finding Isu artifacts than by trusting in the guy who claimed to meet an actual descendant? I know, but I need you to trust me. You could be right. This spear, this book, it could all be crap. But something tells me it isn't, and I'm certainly not gonna let Abstergo find out first. You're right. We haven't got much to lose anyway. There's just one small problem. What is it? This manuscript is in rough condition, to say the least. The DNA found on the spear has identified two different individuals. You're gonna have to pick which strand of DNA to pursue. The choice is yours. He will lead us down the right path, I'm sure. All right, boss. We're finally good to go. 431 BCE, here we come! The start of Peloponnesian War. Good luck in there. No pressure or anything, but we're all depending on you. Abstergo isn't gonna win this time. If what the book says is true and we do actually find the artifact, the assassins will finally have a chance to rise again. You can do it! Owen Victoria, read the book. It holds the secrets I won't be able to find on my own when I'm in there. Aye, aye, Captain.
shit face! Get down here! Cyclops got a message for you. <clears throat> Tell your boss he can stick it. That's for last week! <clears throat> Malaka! The Cyclops said you like to act tough, so act tough! Get a little closer and I will. You should know by now. The Cyclops always collects his debt. You have a lesson to learn. If the Cyclops wants to teach you, tell him to come here himself. Never mess with the Cyclops! <laughs> Last week? <laughs> this shit happens every week. <sighs> I can't keep doing this. <whistles> nah. Thanks for the warning. Ah. <sighs> What happened to you? It's nothing, Phoebe. All taken care of now. The Cyclops again, huh? Hasn't he learned his lesson yet? Apparently not. Of course. Help yourself. You hungry too, Icarus? <laughs> Do you think Zeus will bless me with an eagle like he blessed you, Alexios? Maybe you could ask him for me. I'll try to put in a good word for you. Finally. So, what are you doing here? Oh, I almost forgot. Marcos is looking for you. <sighs> what does that weasel want now? Don't know. He wants you to meet him at his new house. On his vineyard. Wait, what? A vineyard? Malaka. It's on the road to Sami. He says wine will make him rich. Since when has he had the vineyard? Yesterday, I think. So, Marcos, who owes me that me, is buying vineyards. With what money? I don't know. Where can I find Marcos's new... Beautiful estate. You know the statue of Zeus on Mount Ainos? It's south of that. Well, I guess I owe Marcos a little visit. Thank you, Phoebe. <coughs> I'll go tell Marcos you're coming. You made a mistake coming here. I'll have to go up top to get dressed. Let's get this on.
Guess this is the vineyard. Straight ahead. There you are. Let's see what you've gotten yourself into this time, Marcos. I keep telling you, you you can't do that. Why? It's my farm. I can plant what I want. The grapes will die here. All of them. You have to forget what you know about the past, my friend. Together, we will revolutionize winemaking. Believe me, you will look back on this day and... Alexios, thank the gods. Phoebe found you in time. I can still hear you. I was worried sick. The Cyclops sent his scum to find you. I think they mean you harm. I wish you would have told me that before they hit me. But that's besides the point. You bought a vineyard, Marcos? A vineyard? Why not? I like wine, you like wine, everybody likes wine. Everybody buys wine. Why not from me? Because you don't know how to grow grapes or make wine. I'm a fast learner. You grow grapes on the vine, then you get some wine. Oh, it's that simple, is it? You know me better than to think I don't have a plan. Marcos always has a plan. All right. Then do you have the money you owe me? Do I have the money I owe you? Uh, of course, of course. Well, no, not at the moment. Then get it. Instantly, my friend, instantly. But uh, maybe you should do that. There is a merchant in Sami. I'm not very good at these things, as you know. You want me to collect my own debt? It's just waiting for you and Sami, my friend. Who's the merchant? Luris. You know Luris. He's very nice. Luris? How stupid can you get? Stop giving him money. He always pays me back. After I threaten him? Exactly. Everybody benefits. Luris gets his money, I get my interest, and you have work. Kefalonia is wonderful, is it not? It better have my money, Marcos. I'd hate to have to sell our vineyard. Of course he will. Oh, after, there's another matter I want to discuss with you. After. Fine, but I'm taking a horse. It's too hot and too long a walk to go on foot. But... Think of it as interest, Marcos. Everybody benefits. Of course, my friend. You shall have your pick. I've made my choice. Which one will it be? The one on the left. Ah, uh, a uh, uh, fine choice. But this particular breed has a few quirks that you might not be aware of. I wouldn't want you to take an unworthy horse. This is the one I want. Are you sure? Because... I'm sure, Marcos. Everybody benefits, especially you. You've chosen the great Phobos. He's never let me down. Phobos. Remember, meet me at the temple in Sami when you have uh, your money from Duris. Ah, Efterpi. There's plenty of wine left to buy. Don't fret. Not now, you fool. Phoebe's been taken. By who? Thugs of the Cyclops. Who else? Snatched her right off the main road. Tell me where they went. In the direction of Itimena Beach. The beach? Can she swim? I'll get her. Yes, go. But don't forget about dear Duris, Alexios. <laughs> no 
easy now. You don't look so good. I angered them, I think. The gods. Uh-oh. Murder or impiety? Neither. I used to worship Hermes at the Drogorati cave. There are gods there too, you know. In the cave? They grant wishes if you bring them tribute. So everyone makes an offering and asks for something in return. Ah, no wishes of mine granted though. I'm running out of money and tribute. I'm poor myself, you know. I did something wrong. You know Hermes. He can be a trickster. Oh, but there are many gods in this cave. All asking for different things. Go hear him yourself. You'll get my last tribute if you do. I need to know if they're real. All right, don't worry. I'll go. Oh, thank you. Remember, be careful where you step, Mystios. You'll be walking on holy ground. We'll see about that. Someone dropped offerings here. Looks like they were trying to carry them away behind the statue. There's a draft here. A crack in the wall. I should be careful. High security here. All I can offer you is devotion, but I need your help. I'm poor. I have four hungry children and nothing else. I weave baskets for the market, but my cart is ruined. How can I repair it? Or sell my wares without it? Without you? I'm listening, child of Hermes. Oh, mighty God, I beg you, help me. Your prayer is... heard. You will find riches at your door sooner than you expect. I knew you'd listen. 
My every sunrise and sunset is yours. Everything beneath my humble roof in Sami is devoted to you. Yes! Now, go home and wait for fate to intervene. I will, great god, I will. Well, if money is what she needs, the bandit's stolen loot will do just fine. No gods in the caves, only bandits stealing people's hopes and drag me. <gasps> I knew it! Thieves! At least you know you won't face Zeus's wrath. Maybe he'll take pity on you. I hope Zeus bring his wrath on those bandits. Don't worry, I brought mine. That should be good enough. Just like she said, the cart looks pretty worse for wear. Looks like these new baskets were off to market, until the cart broke. This should help. Better them than the bandits. Mighty Kefalus, I entreat you, send us a champion, someone worthy of your mighty spear. Help your priestess in her hour of need. You called? <gasps> oh, Alexius, you startled me. Why are you looking for a champion? I need someone worthy to win the spear of Kefalus. I've been deciphering some of the sanctuary stone carvings. They say the spear was hidden in the caves beneath Kefalonia when the temple was built. You could get it for me, couldn't you? I can give you a reward. If the spear is in the caves, I'll find it. Well, maybe you were sent by Kefalus. I'll see what I can find. Oh, thank you. I'll prepare a spot in the sanctuary.
I should try to stay out of sight. I never lose! <laughs> Alexios, have you come back to talk about the spear? I have. Oh, good. Tell me, did you find it? Consider it a donation to the temple. What? No reward? Oh, Alexios, I'm in your debt. If ever there's a way my temple can help you, or anyone, send them here. I will remember.
There they are. I'll sneak up on the Malakas. Let me go! Shut it! Or I'll tighten those ropes! She'll make good ransom drachmi for the Cyclops. No one's gonna buy me from you. They're all poor. Keep quiet, Phoebe. This tall grass will keep me hidden. Can't let the rest of those malakas get away. Be out of here. Alexios, I'm here. Untie me. Are you all right? It wasn't so bad. Last time they put a cloth in my mouth so I'd stop biting. Phoebe, just be careful. You're alone now since. Since my parents died? I'm okay. I've got you, and you've got me and Marcos. We're your family, right? You'll have to be stronger than that! Talk you in! Let him have it! Got you! <laughs> Again! Up! Yes, Pater. A Spartan rises as soon as they have fallen. Ready or stop? Widen your stance. A soldier grounds themselves. Hmm? Good. Good. Uh. Approach me. Ah! That's enough, Nikolaus. The sun's going down. Time to eat, don't you think? <laughs> what are we eating tonight? Tonight. We are having baby Cassandra! <laughs> and what a feast she will be! No, not her! Take me instead, I'm tasty! Yes, yes, you're all sweet as honey. Now, come inside. The lamb's turning black. Here. Yeah. Lay her in bed. Yes, Pater. Alexios. You. Are my greatest pride. Remember that. You will bring this family to glory. Go. Right. You worry too much. <laughs> you don't worry enough. We'll be alright if we watch out for each other. Which reminds me, the thug said you should watch your back. What'd they say? They said the Cyclops put a big bounty on you. Talos the Stonefist wants you dead. Talos, the mercenary. Oh, am I ever not in trouble? Better get him before he gets you. I hear he's really mean. I'll find my way back to town. Here! Dalos the stone feast? That's just what I need today. Another broken nose. I'm going to have to take care of that.
this bounty, Talos. <laughs> <laughs> 